Hello and welcome to my video in where I show you the thing you still want to know about the Electroharmonics Metamath. A disclaimer, this seems to be the greatest pedal in the world, but it's just a tribute. So here we have both the Metal Muff and the Boss Heavy Metal HM2 and due to the fact that I already did an in-depth review of the Metal Muff last Sunday, I won't go into any detail for the pedal itself and what the knobs actually do. Instead we directly go to the EQ curves and we activate the Heavy Metal and then we activate the Metal Muff. The knobs are all at noon and then I try to achieve the curve that's most similar to the HM2 curve. So here we start. First I let the top boost deactivate it and we already have three quite interesting peaks at 120Hz, at 900Hz and at 5.01 and I think this one is the treble. So, but first of all let's reduce the gain. Okay, now let's crank the mid and crank the base. So we kind of get a similar curve. We have a mid gap, we have a low peak and a high peak, but every peak is kind of shifted in frequency and the gap isn't as drastic. So let's find out what top boost can do. Okay, just add some more around the 4 kilohertz. So this I might reduce the bass a bit, but when I reduce the bass, the mid gap actually disappears. So yeah, I think that's the closest that I can get. And now let's have a listen when we actually hear how both pedals sound. Thank <laughs> you. 
So to state the obvious, in front of the clean amp the Metal Muff has nothing to do with the HM2. It is just a, I dare to say, generic distortion pedal, doesn't sound anything at all like the HM2. In front of the distorted channel, however, you get some really similar results, although it has way more bass and it doesn't have this low chuck, I don't know how to call it or how to explain what it sounds to me. So it's a good alternative if you don't own an HM2 but you don't want to limit yourself to the HM2 sound and I think it's a good additional layer for an HM2 sound or maybe an, a B sound for a different guitar or the center track of your mix. So anyways I think it's, it's a good sound but it's not the HM2 sound. It comes close but it's not identical of course. Anyways, that's it for today. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. May the force be with you and have a nice day.